Leo. Well done on the latest speech. Oh my God, absolutely loved all the cool pop culture references. But you know those songs and films that you love to quote? They are made by artists. They be the guys now to have lost their jobs at the very start of the pandemic due to social distancing and they'll be amongst the very last to get them back as well, sadly. So would yourself and them, um, Josepha, you've got to see her. Think of investing in the arts at all, no? What's that? Josepha's already given them one million. <laughs> we all thought that was a joke. One million for the entire sector. Sure, New Zealand are after investing a hundred million in the arts. But then again, they are led by a, a progressive, vibrant, empathetic woman. If only there was such a woman waiting in the wings here. Hello. Now, Leo, I know you and a lot of blue shirts think that most artists, with the exception of maybe Bono and Kylie Minogue, are effectively dull bird, soap dodging Marxists. But even if you hate the artist, think of all the ancillary workers vital to make the art happen. Costume designers, set builders, technicians, drivers, etc. Imagine the devastating blow to the economy if you let all those people go under, as well as the detestable poet, painter or actor. Imagine forgetting about economics entirely, even just for a minute. Imagine life without art. Forget about our bank accounts. Imagine the effect on our hearts, on our heads. What would we watch and read? during the next pandemic. Where would you get all your cool quotes for your speeches? And to the arts councils, is there any chance you'd make the application process just even a little bit more straightforward, guys? Does it seem fair to you that there's less paperwork and fewer hoops to jump through to secure a well-paid salaried arts administration position than for the artist to get a couple of grand worth of scraps from the funding table once a year. And even if you get the scraps, you've wasted a month trying to win application games, and the money you receive is almost certainly going on rent and food, as opposed to the art itself, because you literally have no other supports. The powers that be in this country seem to be screaming at the artists. We don't value you. Unless you've won some sort of award, then you can come in for a quick photo, but otherwise, piss off. Well, you know something, guys? Maybe someday soon, they will.